Episode 79 of the LA series. The episode took Luke at a company that owned the Power Rangers franchise until Boy and Avista brought it out. Talking about Saban Brands. Saban Entertainment was founded in 1980 as Saban Productions. However, sometime around the 90s, I think, they renamed to Saban Entertainment. In 2002, Saban Entertainment went defunct, but in 2011, Saban came back as Saban Brands. We have five logos. Their first one is called the Saban Planet, seen from 1984 to 1988. The font may be reminiscent of Pac-Man. Their next logo is the washing machine in space, since it looks like one, and it was seen from 1988 to 1996. The logo looks like a washing machine. Hence the nickname. Their next logo is the Twirly Woo, their most famous logo, seen from 1996 to 2002. <laughs> this logo did hold up from 1996 and for six years. I know someone who is scared of this. Now I can get to Saban Brands. Their next logo is called the Earth, seen from 2011 to 2017. Good comeback of the Saban name. Their last logo under the Saban brand's name is the Gold Earth, seen from 2017 to 2018. This is a worthy successor to the previous, which sadly wasn't used much at all. So that's it. See you on episode 80, season 8 premiere. Ladies and gentlemen, see you all in the bridal later. Good night, folks. Presenta.